Wow, I can't believe how good Nano Banana is. In this video, I'm gonna show you how we're gonna take Google's brand new Nano Banana image editing technology, connect it to NADN workflows, combine it with Google's VO3, and create stunning $1,000 ads in seconds. A few hours ago, Google released their new image model codenamed Nano Banana. It's now Gemini 2.5 Flash. It's an image generator that rivals ChatGPT's ImageGen, Flux Context, and many people are saying is the best AI image generator on the market. And this is a huge deal because Google already has the best video model out there by far, in my opinion, VO3. And now you can use Nano Banana to generate that start image that you can create an amazing video ad with. Also, what's super cool about Nano Banana is they have both a text to image and an image editing. I have a Mr. Beast thumbnail, I have a picture of me, and boom, you can see the result is pretty good and the character is relatively consistent. Here we have another example very similar to my last video where I took the AG1 product and I took a mid-journey image of a model and boom, you could see the character consistency, especially on this output, is absolutely stunning. You can currently use this model right now, as you see Gemini 2.5 flash image preview in Google's AI studio but it's also available on API. But I've already connected it to my N8N template and I can make these images on autopilot. But before we do that, let me show you how to do this the manual way in case you don't wanna to have to use an automation. So right now we're on the foul playground, which allows you to do this. And the cost is only four cents per output, as well as it being relatively fast. You can also do this on the Gemini Studio, like I said, and I think it includes quite a few renders on every single plan. Um, what I did for this right here is I uploaded an image of myself along with an image of Mr. Beast and then I just gave it this simple prompt right here. I then downloaded the image and now I'm gonna be going to Flow Studio. Okay, now we're on Google Flow. We already have an account. I have an Ultra account, but if you have any paid account in the US, you should be able to do this. We're on VO3 Fast. It's gonna cost me roughly 20 cents worth of credits. I'm gonna be on Frames to Video. I'm gonna to go to this button right here. I'm going to upload this image of myself as Mr. Beast. I'm gonna hit Crop and Save. And then that's gonna load in right there. And the second it loads, we're gonna give it this prompt, this super simple prompt to just add some dialogue. I'm gonna send this off and we'll see what it looks like. Okay, now we got the results and I'll play it for you. Wow, I can't believe how good Nano Banana is. So the combination of Nano Banana and VO3 is absolutely stunning in my opinion. I was able to upscale this. I went to 11 labs. I went to the voice changer. I just dragged in the video, had it changed to my voice, and I'll play that for a second. Wow, I can't believe how good Mano Banana is. So my voice is not perfect, I would say, but I do like how you still get a little bit of that echo that it generated, which was super cool. So I'm gonna be placing that at the beginning of my video, and then let's move on. Now let's do a manual test of a UGC ad. So this one right here I think is absolutely stunning. I love how they have the table and the little spoon right here, but the person is carrying the product. Just so good. And you'll notice that it's vertical. So we're gonna go to Key AI and use their vertical VO3 rendering to try to make an ad out of this. So I'm just gonna download the image now. If you guys don't know, I'm currently on key.ai. The link will be in the description. These people provide a VO3 service that allows you to do vertical videos, which is super cool. So I selected that right here. We're gonna be uploading the image and it's gonna cost us 40 cents for a VO3 fast rendering. So it's gonna be a little bit more expensive, but you don't need any subscription to do this. So I'm just going to be selecting that file that we generated on Nano Banana, which is also a good resolution. Another thing that they one up ChatGPT is you can do more resolutions with this. I'm going to give it this simple prompt right here and then I'm going to hit generate and show you the results. Okay, so the video rendered, I changed the prompt slightly and rendered it one more time and then I'm going to be playing it right now. I used to take 12 different supplements every morning. So that's the beginning of the video. You can see it's a little bit of a low resolution and that's because of the whole VO3 workaround. So basically what I did here is I went to Topaz Labs. I upscaled it 1.5X. This cost me a couple of cents and I'll show you what the final result looks like. 
and I'll also have that link in the description. Here's the final results. Let's see how well it did. I used to take 12 different supplements every morning. Now it's just one scoop of Athletic Greens and I feel better than ever. So it's really good. I guess the one thing I should probably tell the prompt is to take the cap off of the bottle before drinking it. But obviously the more creative you get with the prompts, the better the result will be. And I think this is absolutely stunning, especially given that I can create this on autopilot. So we're gonna be going into that now. Okay, and on that note, I wanted to give a shout out to my school, which is currently only $10 per month. I'm gonna be raising the price very soon, as soon as we release this new template that I've been talking about. It's an AI creative agency template, and the idea is it empowers people to make as many ads as quick as possible using N8N automations. And of course, we're gonna be plugging in and have already plugged in Nano Banana. So make sure to check that out, and I highly recommend you join soon because there's going to be so much value here. This is the entire template so far. It can create taglines for your product. It can create images using ChatGPT's image gen. It can create UGC via ChatGPT's image gen. It can use VO3 to create those into videos. And then boom here, the new module that I whipped up in the last hour, and that's the Nano Banana UGC module. And I'll show you how that works right now. So if you didn't watch the last video, I'll catch you up to speed. Essentially, we have this Google Sheets, which is the entire database for everything you're doing. We have the product image here linked, so it knows to use the AG1 product. And then over in the image controls UGC, here you can put images of models that you want to be carrying your product. So we have these, for example, they're essentially these ones that I generated on Midjourney. There will be a ton more in the future. And then as you can see right here, you can set which ones you want it to do. So I'm going to go to the image outputs now to show you what it's like. We have these two that were just outputted onto a Google Drive that's really easy to send to a client and also to turn into videos using VO3. So these are the results right here. You have this one model holding the AG1, and then you have the second one. Both of these were generated with Nano Banana. And um, now I'm gonna go back into the image controls UGC. We're gonna be generating a version of Mike, and I'll show you what the output looks like. So it's pretty simple. We just have Mike on to do. Then we go over to this module. We connected the trigger to this one over here. It's gonna take the product image is going to take Mike's image is going to use nano banana combine them and then upload it and then put it onto our sheet so let's just execute workflow right here and see if it does it correct on the first try of course every time I try this on video the UI bugs out but essentially everything should be very quick except for this 50 second wait that we have here just to make sure that it's generated the image okay I'm gonna be trying one more time there we go, now we have the UI. You can see it's getting the product links. It's then sending the request to Nano Banana, and then we're gonna wait 50 seconds. Okay, it's now uploading the file to Google Drive, and let's go check the sheet. And as you can see, image outputs, there's now three results, and then we have this one of Mike holding it right here. So let me open that up. And boom, this is a result. And to be honest, I don't really like it, but that's specifically why I created this in the format it is. You can check all the UGC you create, um, authorize the ones that you like to turn into videos with the video control, and then turn them into video ads extremely seamlessly. So I'm gonna be releasing this entire template to my school community. So I highly recommend that you join there. If not, you can already do this on your own. Fell Gemini 2.5 Flash, the, all the instructions is on the API page. Essentially, you're gonna do HTTP request, and I'll kind of pop this up really quickly. You're gonna to need to connect your Fell account here. You're just going to give the JSON that it gives you, and then for the image URLs, this is for editing images, by the way, you're just gonna pass those images here, and then you're gonna get a response URL. You're just going to load that response URL after roughly a minute when it generates, and then you can go on and basically incorporate Nano Banana into all your products. Now, Key AI also has a Nano Banana, which is cheaper, so I'm gonna be testing that soon. That's only two cents per generation, but I wanna get this video out there really quick because Nano Banana just dropped, so please make sure to join the school if this template is something that you find interesting, and I'll see you guys later.